So I've got a very yummy breakfast this morning. So I've got three slices of bacon medallions. They are free. And I've got baked beans. They are free. And I'm pretty sure... No, they're not protein, I don't think. They're free. My eggs are free in protein. I've got two of those. And then the eggs were done in fry light. And then I've got mushrooms, which is speed. And some fresh tomatoes that I've chopped up. And they are speed. So yeah, we got a yummy breakfast this morning and we are currently uh, watching the Queen's funeral on the telly, which of course is a very sad day. So we're going to eat this and then carry on watching that. I'm having my breakfast for lunch today. This is the last portion, portion of the rice pudding um, and it's a bit runny this last lot, but anyway, I'm sure it'll taste fine. So... It's uh, the pudding rice is free, and as usual, I got straw not strawberries, I'm getting my words wrong today raspberries and blueberries for speed food, and some sweetener just to sweeten it up a little bit. And um, I will confirm later again if I'm using the milk as my healthy extra A or sins. And I'm finishing off with an orange, which is a speed food, and the Muller Light for half a sin. I'll just show you, um, I've done some baking this morning. So I made these rock cakes for the family. So they smell and look delicious. And then I made this, um, I think it's called Eve's Pudding, but I call it a uh, apple sponge on top. That is just a bit missing that my husband's tried. So yeah, basically it's just stewed apple at the bottom. And then sponge mi mixture on top. So they will probably have that with some custard. And then I had sponge mixture left. So then I made some of these. And she was having cheese on toast and I really fancied it. So I've come home and done two slices of the Neville's bread. And then I've topped that with 40 grams of Cathedral City Lighter, which is my healthy extra A. And then I've got some red onion on top and uh, cherry tomatoes, which are both speed. And then I put that under the grill. So it's my healthy extra B and a healthy extra A for my tea. So I am having this little bit of apple sponge pudding and there's a tiny bit of custard on there. Um, so I will think about what I'm going to sin it as. But I haven't had any sins today apart from the yoghurt. So yeah, anyway, I'm going to really enjoy this. So you'll be um, seeing this on Tuesday morning because I just felt that um, to show respect to Her Majesty that I wouldn't upload it um, tonight, which tonight is Monday, so you'll see this Tuesday morning. So it's been a very sad, emotional day. Um, we watched the majority of the funeral and what we didn't see, we have um recorded on sky so we've got that to watch so yeah but anyway before i carry on with what i've eaten i'll just show you show, don't show my big bingo wings but these they don't show up as well here but you can see this one is very very sore and inflamed and it's very, very much like ringworm. I've got one here. Uh, I've got one here. It's not picking up on camera. And then I've got another little one here. And I've got two that looks like that on my leg. And then i got other things going on on my leg. So I honestly don't know what the hell. It is, I really don't. Um, so I'll be on the phone again in the morning to the doctors because when I tell you it's itching, oh my God, it is keeping me awake at night. It's horrendous. And, you know, you know, like when the kids had chicken box, you have to tell them, don't keep scratching, stop scratching. But when you've got such an itch like that, it's near impossible not to scratch it. So, yeah, my legs are in an awful state. I won't show you the state of my legs, but 
they really are terrible I just do not know what it is so and then they've got a big big patch of it on my thigh so yeah and um, my lady's problem is still here as well so all in all it's not looking very good for me so anyway tomorrow but today for you now you're watching this on Tuesday it is way day a day late for me this week because obviously with everything that happened today um so I mean my second way in after my holiday my second way in at this new group I should be feeling very positive I I am feeling positive as in the for what I've eaten but because I have got the ladies problem again which just seems to stand in my way all the time um, that is what's making me feel a little bit negative and worried but we'll see what tomorrow brings so so I'm ending today now you saw that I had that little piece of apple and sponge I was trying and trying to resist it but it didn't happen but it was delicious so so what I've had is um, I came to the rice pudding of sins because I'd use cheese for my tea although that rice pudding I hadn't le left it go thick enough it was so runny but anyway it's gone now it was really nice tasting it was just so runny um, and then I'd half a sin on my yogurt at lunch um, I've put in for this evening a hi-fi bar for three sins. Now, if I do have that, that's leaving me with eight and a half sins left, which I'm kind of thinking, I'm hoping that's going to cover me for the apple sponge. So, I don't know. But, we'll see. Um... Something else I was going to say to you. This itching is driving me so crazy. My mind is just elsewhere. So yeah, so so this now is obviously up for you on Tuesday morning. Um, and I've got way in today. But I'm not going to put a video up of my way in and my normal shopping haul. I'm changing it now from just the one day a week I'm changing it because I find it it is a lot on way day for me to film what I'm eating, to film my way in update, to film the shopping haul and you know with everything else that I do anyway and family and editing and all that it is a little bit too much and I, I get a little bit like stressed and so to make things a little bit easier, I've decided that on way day, um, because my eating is going to be very sparse anyway on way day, because I'm going to eat very, well, I'm going to eat my breakfast, but I'm going to eat very little at lunch because I'm obviously weighing later. So I've made overnight oats for breakfast. Um, lunch, I'm just going to keep it very, very light. Might just do like a sweet omelette or something and then whatever for tea so I'm not going to film what I eat on way day because it's just going to be very sparse anyway um so I what I'll do then is it is confusing this week because the days are different so on Wednesday I will have scheduled for seven o'clock on Wednesday morning um my weigh-in update and then I'll put my shopping haul I think onto Wednesdays what I ate for the day um, and then that just makes it so much easier for me and I'm not doing it all on weigh day because I get home late anyway on weigh day so that's what I'm going to do but I'll, I'll say again towards um, next week weigh day because obviously it'll be back to Monday next week so yeah Anyway, fingers crossed for my way in. I hope I hope I get at least a pound. You know, if I can get a pound, obviously I'd like more. But as long as I get a loss, then I'll be quite happy. Um, so I will. I won't see you now until Wednesday morning, which is when you'll see my way in update, and then Wednesday evening for my what I ate in the day and my shopping haul. 
so thank you so much for watching and if you could like the video and if you're not already subscribed it'd be great if you followed me for the rest of this journey and yeah i'll see you all then bye Thank <laughs> you.